Welcome everybody to Escape the Depths, a Minecraft, as the name would probably entail, escape map. I'm actually super excited, uh, super excited to do this map. I, <clears throat> excuse me, I haven't done a, an escape map in forever, so super excited. Uh, map is multiplayer comp compatible, you know me, I'm a single player guy. Uh, there is a walkthrough, make sure my audio's on. Uh, read written books, there's information in them. You only need to craft armor, tools, weapons. Don't waste time crafting 100 furnaces. Oh, there are some rules. Don't cheat. No problem. If you're stuck, walk through. If you're making a video, shout out would be greatly appreciated. Uh, map is made by EPC1220. Uh, Read all the books. Enjoy the map. Ooh. Uh, how did we get here? Well, I... I hit a button. Bump up the master volume here a bit. Let's go. Click to repeat all used hints. Okay. So on puzzle maps like this, I find you're really walking around blindly for the longest time while you learn the stuff the creator's style of of play of creation. Hmm. Very odd structure. How did I get here? Oh, I don't have to worry about food, saturation, nothing. I'm golden. I'm looking great. Oh, our first little hint. Use stone to mine. Use stone to mine iron. I'm going to need iron for something. Little iron vein over there. What do I use wood to mine? That's probably part of the puzzle. You see, usually when you play an adventure map, it'll tell you, hey, this can mine copper. Hey, this can only mine this. Oh, can break oak logs and planks. Notebook. Can break cobblestone. This can only break cobblestone. Well, let's grab all this oak. This could be important later. Can break oak planks and logs. That might not. Okay. Ooh, what's this down here? Oh! That jump scared the shit out of me. Oh! Hello, William. Um, I dropped it on my way out of the cave, but couldn't retrieve it without him sensing me. Anyways, I bet you're probably confused as to where you are. Very much so. Uh, this place used to be my home. I dug down to escape the threat of night, but little did I know the depths are more dangerous. Uh, uh than I anticipate. They're called skulls, freaky blue wavy things. I've never seen, unfortunately. There's a guard down there. Him. He senses vibrations just like the skulk in much more horrific fashion. Oh, I have to fight a warden. Oh god, I gotta fight the warden. So I hid my lab in a difficult to traverse cavern. In my research, I learned that the weakness of Skulk is amethyst. It's o the only way to pierce through it. I've begun to cover my path with blockades of Skulk-infused materials with the hopes of deterring him. Your only way out is to craft new amethyst tools using my amethyst forger. In order to access the farm, you need to get to the control panel, which is in my corridor beneath the cave. I can open it from there, um, but I have no control over anything else. Ooh. It's iron pickaxe gold. Oh, it means break. Okay, yeah, I did notice that sign earlier. That was a really awesome little intro cutscene. That was very well done. Uh, cobblestone, cobblestone. Apparently we're not counting that as cobblestone. I don't know. Very odd. Very odd indeed. Cobblestone? Nice. So now I can get... What? Oh, I can... Let's make only what I need. 
Now I can break iron ore and blocks of coal. Okay, that's progress. So I'm going through a I'm going through like a tool tree here. Let's get enough. So let's see here. A block of coal can a single coal can smelt eight iron. So let's get enough to let's just gather up enough to make that iron pick, I guess. Stone can break cobblestone. Yes, stone can do iron. No problem. Good. Good, good, good. That's more than enough. Now, where do I find coal? What? Nope, there's a block of coal there. Okay, that's... We're progressing. We're progressing. No problems. I have a few blocks of coal here. Now, is there a furnace area? I can't believe there's no furnace area. I, I would have thought that um, there would have been just a, a furnace or something somewhere. Unless that could be it up there. Hello, anything up here? See that nether portal? Nether portal? Oh, yes. See that nether portal? That's where we need to go. There's no way to get up there, so we need to build a portal to make our way up there. I've come to the conclusion that the only way up is down. We need need to dig deeper. Oh. Interesting. So the lore, or my objectives, are cleverly scattered around here. I like that. This is almost like a... Oh my gosh, escape maps. I almost said the, uh, the escape map is almost like an escape room. Duh. I accidentally used the, used the hint. Well, what happens if I do go down deeper? Will I find my crafting bench? That was cool. Hello? I've gone deeper. Uh, iron mines gold. Yes. Iron does mine gold, but... I need to have the ability to smelt it before it's of any use. Did I happen to miss a, a smeltery around here? Oh, wait, there's blast furnaces. I can use a blast furnace, right? Yeah, you can you can tell. Despite the fact I have uh, I've been a uh, I've been a Minecrafter for years, I don't know what shit looks like around here. Let's grab a uh, there was a crafting bench over here. Oh, there's four of them. All right. Gold time. Ow. Oh. I didn't break my legs. No problem, then. Oh, hello. Ooh. Magic beans, do not eat. Ooh, entry log one. More. Yesterday I encountered a creature of large stature and horrifying proportions. He governs the deep dark in the ancient cities. He feeds on... His name is the Warden. Uh, I have explored all my past techniques are obsolete. I uh, research on various things. Skulk censored. Scares me the most. The Skulk Shrieker. Yep. Good luck, William. Oh. Uh, within eight blocks, it's a redstone signal. Oh, cool. All right. Neat. I have my iron pickaxe. Where was the gold? Here we go. Gold. All right, I have gold. Now what do I do with the gold? This is really cool. I like this map. It, it really... It's nice to play something where, you know, I've got to... I have to think a lot. Well, I should just... I should try to make a gold pick to see what it does. There's plenty of gold around here. I think there's even gold over that way. Gold pick. Okay, apparently I got a little too... carried away here. Well, you know what? I still have gold. 
I have mine gold. I've got five gold. That's enough to do things with, I'm sure. Amethyst recipes. Amethyst hoe, six amethyst shards, three gold bars, two, three iron bars, two sticks. Oh, so I need the... Can I mine amethyst? I can't yet. Not with any of the tools that I have currently. Which is a shame. Okay. So I know I need to be able to mine amethyst, but how? I will mine more gold, though, while I'm here. Because I'm sure I'm going to need a ass load of gold. I've been drawn... This is made, made available for a reason. Magical beans do not eat. I wonder if I'm supposed to compost them. I guess until something explicitly tells me to compost them, I'm not touching them. Oh, that's what you do with that. Okay, that makes sense now. Very good, very good. Oh, wait, nope, there's another book there. Compass of the Depths. In order to leave the caverns, you must forge all the tools you can use them to access the Compass of Depths, which you need to open the gate. Uh, my high-tech lab. To find, you must... The gate is hit is at my hidden exit from my base. It leads to my high-tech lab. To find it, you must climb at the light in the cozier part of my base downstairs. You have to climb at the cozier part of his base. Yeah, I've got to climb up here. Ha-ha! <laughs> oh. Well, that took a while, and me eventually just breaking down and going to creative mode, but I made it up here. Huh. And there's nothing but some skulk. Nothing hidden down here at all. And I don't have anything that can break skulk yet. Hmm. All right, I think this is as good as any place to end it for today. I need to do a little bit more investigating and figure out exactly what I need to be doing. Thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode. <laughs>